What are we looking at today is another vintage Reebok above the rim Insta Pump Vertical 4. Excellent pair is one of my all time favorites. Hey guys, welcome back to Kicks Reasons channel. And I managed to add it another vintage Reebok above the rim Insta Pump Vertical 4 into my collection to add it to ever expanding collection of verticals. You guys know I have this one. I have the two high models. I have another one, which is the black version, the new book, black and white and Royale. This is the reverse colorway, which is the white leather based version with the black accents. And we have the black midsole with the black and Royale vector and the black pump. Now this is, this is the one to get. If you guys manage to see this one anywhere online and it's in a good condition, just don't hesitate, grab it because genuine leather, just like this one will never crumble and we know new book looks great when it's new and i love the black colored versions of the shoe but unfortunately over time they crack and crumble and they peel off and they are unwearable on the flip side this is completely wearable this is completely wearable even today almost 30 years later and i'm super excited to get these one in my hand so these came from the uk i, I saw them on ebay there was a seller in uk selling them for like 50 dollars uh, plus shipping and without hesitation i grabbed them they're not perfect they're worn but they are with the perfect working pumps just like all my other ones and this was the thing back in the day somehow all the pumps were working with no any problem and listen to this magical sound i absolutely love it we have the hexawide in the hill is always giant vector logo on the outsole uh, just like this one and the comfort is there and this midsole will never crumble will never deteriorate just that polylite compound is excellent and this shoe is magical side ventilations just like all the other models the designer e scott morris just created a masterpiece with a vertical line and i absolutely love it that little touch with the above the rim logo here on the first lace loop is amazing the pull tabs with the above the rim logos and the reebok vector in the back is also amazing i mean look at this colorway it is absolutely, absolutely mesmerizing and I love it so much. You guys are gonna see this model in a lot of close-ups uh, and details, but uh, yeah, the, the, the things to mention, mention here, unfortunately doesn't come with the insole. Uh, I don't know what happened to it. Uh, <laughs> the seller didn't have it or whatever. And we see some sole separation, which can be fixed. I actually just picked up some uh, specialized for shoes glue that I can repair some of these. Uh, I'm gonna actually gonna make a kind of a video tutorial so you guys can see how easy it is to repair sole separation, which is realistically the only issue here. As of insoles, I have plenty of those. I can drop them in and uh, still wear them. And of course, you guys are gonna see these on feet, see how they look and they're excellent, super comfortable. Uh, and look at this leather, just the leather looks even better <laughs> when it's worn and wrinkled. They stick so much nicer than anything else today. Uh, genuine leather i absolutely love uh, the way that looks and that color combination orlando colorway uh, was just magical back in the day uh, yeah so uh, both of them have functional pumps and i love the way uh, reebok migrated to these kind of a neoprene wrapped uh, tongs on the on the fourth generation uh, they come up with that first and then the fifth one was even further they took it further with a tin chamber insta pump that was implemented in the ton and now this one is just with the neoprene and kind of embossed pump right on top of it hopefully the camera picks it up otherwise you're going to see it on the close-ups but yeah this uh, this colorway is very nice very very nice almost entirely this shoe is made out of genuine leather there's some small accents here and there with uh, kind of a synthetic leather but you can't even tell where they are most of it is genuine leather thick nice leather and this is excellent to see again this beautiful outsole with the hexalite intact because it's placed above the midsole right underneath your heel it's not in the bottom just like the older models when they started moving those above the midsole it was absolutely great for comfort and protection of the hexalite in the bottom yeah another great addition to the collection super excited to have this one and expand my vertical collection i believe right now i'm probably the person to have the most of those uh, beautiful shoes 
But yeah, as always, guys, hit the thumbs up if you like the video. Stay tuned to the channel. Subscribe if you're new. There will be a lot more videos coming very, very soon. I have some exciting new sneakers coming, even some newer models. But as always, guys, you have a wonderful day.